good app so you can try that all the books which were covered in separate uh, sections that was very nice overall i think every in every possible way it was covered flashcards were there and slides were there videos were there so i bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of speed medical institute to dr preeti kumari gond and for scoring a topmost rank of rank number 1 in aml in specialty of mch breast and endocrine surgery in any ss session april 2024 congratulations to you doctor thank you so much sir doctor can we know your brief background from where you started till date what all you have done sir so i have done my post graduation from aims bhubaneswar then after completing i joined as sr here aims bhubaneswar then in march i resigned because i thought i should sit and study so one and a half months i sat down and i started studying Great doctor. MBBS from doctor. MBBS from uh, Rajendra Institute of Medical Sciences, Ranchi. Fantastic, doctor. Why MCH breast and endocrine surgery? Sir, uh, in PG time, what I saw in my patients are uh, there is so much unawareness among the population, rural populations mostly. They are not aware of what is happening to them. They are mostly presenting in late stages in which we cannot do much. So since then I developed an interest that I want to do something in this field. I want to make some difference so that the ladies who are not aware, who are untouched by the modern developments we are we are having, at least they can get benefited. Especially for breast cancer pathology, is talking about. Yes, yes, mostly I'm more interested in that. So because of uh, the things that I mean, I mean most of the general surgery. Almost eighty percent of men, men, so that they miss out the early breast cancer and stages of early breast cancer yes. because of the inhibition to go and get examined. Yes. And uh, I think, I mean, that is a social cause that you are into right now. And yes. rather than, I mean, of course, could be a passion. And this is a kind of a social intent that to uh, do something in this field so that uh, whatever the best could be delivered and and could make a lot of curable breast cancers in case yes. if it's diagnosed. great doctor we definitely we appreciate the the kind of choice that you have made for a reason is I mean it's a truly uh, mean needed and a great cause now can we know once you decided to do so I mean what all you did and how you started preparation to achieve this rank number 1 so actually this interest i developed in first year only so since first year i started seeing such patients more scrubbing in such cases more and since like in pg i did not study much for uh, uh, competitive purposes after uh, joining my my sr ship then i started studying that uh, i have worked enough now i should start focusing on getting the competition so then i started studying then i saw the videos and cushion banks and belly belly and sarastan i had studied so i compiled everything i made my own notes from all the sources and then that revision only i did i think it worked great how you came across speed how did you get into the learning was suggested uh, by one of my seniors that this is a good app so you can try that so I said, okay let me see and i found it then i took the subscription and so how how was the classes do you are able to do the classes and how your learning experience was there in speed it was good sir all the books which were covered in separate uh, sections that was very nice and questions are questions were good i could like correlate because i had given earlier attempt in my pg time that time i could correlate okay fine question is coming from this question and those portions are being covered so i was little bit confident on seeing similar patterns overall i think every in every possible way it was covered flash cards were there and slides were there videos were there so it was like I I saw your videos was like you were saying we'll cover everything. <laughs> everything was covered. Great, doctor. Can you tell us how many questions did you attend this exam? All the questions. Eighty out of eighty. Yes. Clear. Great. And can you share something on your interview part? I mean, experience. What all they asked? I mean, how did you handle it? In interview, first they asked me to introduce myself, and they asked mostly from where I have done my post post graduation. So it was aim. So they were like, they were more interested. What is happening in your person? So that was I told them. Then they started giving me uh, is uh, scenario based questions. 
parathyroid, thyroid breast, all the all the glands they asked, gave me one one scenarios. And they asked me how you're going to manage it, starting from diagnosis, imaging, what to do, what not to do, what will be the operative management. So these they asked, then thesis they asked, what was your thesis? And publication also they were interested in knowing what publications you're having. And they asked me to name all the publications along with the genders in which this published. <laughs> Very nice. Now, what will be your advice for a future aspirants of MCH breast and endocrine surgery? Just like any surgical branch, this is also passion-driven branch. So, I like what I I, I felt in my PG days. Many people who used to get irritated. So many ladies used to come with the same complaint: there is lump, there is lump, there is lump. So it becomes monotonous, and people get irritated. They only like 40, 50 lumps I am seeing in the morning. So, if you are not passionate, don't do it. If you are passionate, then it is very good. And if you are passionate, passion will drive you to start working as soon as possible. So, that those people will not need any inspiration and force. They will find it <laughs> Great, doctor. Now, time to thank and whom all you want to thank, you can use this platform to do so, to build your career so far. Sir, there are so many people I cannot name them. The list is so long, so long. <laughs> I mean, if you want, you can you can take your time also. There's plenty of time available for you. From God, starting from God, parents, all my friends, my guide, my department of gender surgery is for sure. All of them, my seniors, my juniors, everyone. I think every person. I cannot exclude anyone. Not a single person I met who was saying that you cannot do it. And I told them that there is only two, three seats in this uh, session. They told me you need only one. Why are you worried about three sets? You need hmm. one. Go okay. for that one. So, <laughs> Strong motivation. Not a single person I met who told me that it won't, it cannot be. It's like quite motivated, quite a good support system I have. Wonderful, doctor. So we wish you once again all the very best and all the success for a great career in an MCH in endocrine surgery and as a future career. And you are taken for a social cause and you as a passion. And on behalf of all the faculty members of Sweet Medical Institute, we wish you all the very best and all the success. Thank you, sir. Sir, I wanted to say one thing. The safety question which I attempted, I had heard you in one of the videos. You told me you are a surgeon who attempt everything. This is a good take on that. If I know, then I will take. So, I, it was like I took a calculated risk and I think it worked. That line I remembered. So, I would like to thank you for that. <laughs> that is a great note on that. There is when you attend 80, it is not a calculated risk, it is an absolute risk. <laughs> so, that's how it has to be. Uh, I mean, surgeon's mind has to be that way. It is not that I do little like, like, like that. No, do do it fully or don't do it. So, I mean, I am very happy that you just made a note of that advice and it will work and that will give rank number one. Because this is not my take. This is what all the toppers have told me. I have conducted more than thousands of interviews. So, from all those experience, today I have an experience with you. 80 questions you attended rank number one. This I will say tomorrow to someone. <laughs> so, beautiful, excellent and great. Wish you all the best once again. Thank you, sir. Thank you.